Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Andrea. This is Sean. Hey guys. <laughs> we are here to react to Aurora. You know it's a little... I feel like it's golden hour right now. Is oh my it not? gosh. With these lights. You know, that's crazy because this video that we're reacting to happens to be called Golden. What? It's I didn't a know Harry that. Styles cover <laughs> Harry... by Aurora. So, wait. A Harry Styles Did... cover, yes. Did you just say Aurora? Yeah. I already said Aurora, but I guess you must have misheard and didn't hear me. I was too busy in the aura. You're trying to show off your golden lights. <laughs> My golden lights. Happening. Yeah. Uh, and I was a little shook from that introduction you gave me. That was really. I know. Man, I listen, it's hard for me to prepare myself to listen to Aurora because she's my one true love. So, I'm gonna. Why you laugh at that? I'm sorry. Why I, wonder are you if, laughing? I wonder if other reaction channels say that. If they, if they simp over Aurora like yeah. I do, no, because she's my one true love and I am her one true love. Okay. Not friggin' beard in the brain <laughs> reactions. It's like they're not. <laughs> <laughs> The worst reaction to all time. <laughs> Shots fired. Let the reaction beat begin. <laughs> okay, we will watch. <laughs> Relax. So cute, right? Oh That's my so gosh! Awesome with the little sun the thing, little, the little sticker, everything Very about it. It's like you and me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right there, that shot right there. Yeah, you just yeah, clowning just, around. What are you clowning around? <laughs> Doing the heavy lifting, you mean, oh, yeah, yeah, on yeah. guitar? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> far, far away, all the attention being on you. Yeah, it is. That is like it's you. Like and me. Yeah, it's just like us. Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> This is like you. What? She's got the lyrics on her phone right in front of her during a live performance. Does she really? <laughs> yeah, it's awesome. I barely use it's my It's like, phone. go go get it, girl. Actually, yeah, you're pretty awesome. I actually that. never you, do that. You, I don't, yeah, you don't. I'm just, I'm just I didn't clowning. realize that. I'm just clowning on you. But yeah, it's a, hey, it's cover. She's doing her best. Yeah. You know? It's a lot of words. It's by request. These guys are just killing it. Of who I am. Oh, yeah, right. I didn't it's, remember it's, she played. Yeah, I, I feel like this is the first time I've seen her play piano live. I've maybe? never seen From her play piano. Done. Yeah, I like amazing. Guys holding it down, the guitar, rocking the Martin. Very similar to the Martin you have, actually. Oh, no wonder it sounds so good. Right. Mm -hmm. 
It, <laughs> it's no not, wonder it's mine. Yeah, it's no, wonder. no wonder. No wonder it's the connection to me. It's not just because he's a good guitar player or anything. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, you know, it, it, it does kind of have the feel of being thrown together quickly. And if anybody knows that, it's me. Because <laughs> that's how we our entire shows go. You know, I would... I guess I would like from a sonic arrangement, maybe a little more low end. You know, it's kind of funny because we have Twinkly Piano. We have Aurora's the greatest voice in the history of humankind. If it counts, because I'm not sure she is human, because she's very elfish, oh, that's true. you know, or, or ethereal and a goddess in every way. So there's more high end there. Twinkly Piano, high end. And then the Finger guitar, style guitar. Yeah, but, but, and it's, but he's just, for the most part, hitting... The G, B, and E strings. Da, na, 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 na. And every now and then he'll throw in like a bass note with his thumb. But it's all very like... Fluttery. Where's, where's the low M, bro? Give me some of that low Maybe M. we want to be fluttery and golden. Sure. Yeah, maybe that's it. Maybe it's, you know, a, a take on the the whimsical nature of the song. Because sometimes hearts get broken, you know? Yeah. It's not, it's not all complete, as is the sonic spectrum of having like some low end bass notes or whatever. Yeah. It's just like life. You know what I mean? They basically just fairy, verified, mm. fairy fied. Verified, I like that. Fairy fied, verified. a mm. Harry Styles song. Fairy Styles? Fairy Styles. I don't even know how Fairy Styles would even be much different <laughs> than I what know. Harry Styles is now. Yeah. Handsome man. I know. For sure. Very handsome man. Do you prefer modern Harry or old school Harry? Very different Harrys. Very different. I feel like modern Harry is more true to who he is, so I feel like I go with that. That's kind of a political answer. How I, is I it? I feel like you just you just told Harry that you like the Harry that he wants to be, but that wasn't the question. But I don't really. I'm not very emotionally connected to Harry, so whatever okay. he wants, like the, I feel like the art that he's making now or the music he's making now is more what he's always wanted to make, which is what he said in interviews. I prefer modern Harry. So you know why I prefer modern Harry? Why? Because he's not afraid to shop in the women's section. Because if you have a certain build, women's clothes just fit you better. Yeah, he does have the build. right. Mm, that yeah, I feel like me and Harry are probably the same size blouse <laughs> i guess you kind of i guess you kind of do have the harry styles yeah. build i got the harry styles vibe i got that fairy styles <laughs> beach harry vibe styles. program going on yeah i feel yeah. like his music is also different now i feel like the, yeah. when he first started so his solo project seemed like more intense and like depressing i feel like now he's more lighthearted. it's because he's, he's found himself exactly my man out my, there. my answer uh -huh. is that okay great so all right back, to, back aurora. to aurora please play piano and express herself though i have all right i have thoughts on this actually yeah and some people might think that this is going to come off as a criticism of aurora and i do not mean it like this so we finish this and then get to that okay sure yeah <laughs> All right, so it was very squished though. <laughs> not one of her better performances live. Okay, I, I want to say that coming from a place of love for Aurora, thinking that she is an eminent vocalist slash performer of our time. Yeah. Okay, now I think what separates a performance like that, which is a world class singer performing live with her world class repertoire as compared to how she has been in other songs, whether it's Runaway, whether it's Half the World Away, she didn't feel this song like she feels the other ones. And you can tell more than any other singer I've ever experienced when she's really feeling a song. 
right? Uh, she was actually playing that song as a normal world-class performer would with another musician. She was connecting with her guitar player, right? Uh, yeah. They were sharing looks at each other. Aurora, at her best, connects with the song, right? Uh, and she acts out the song, and she kind of becomes the song. And I feel like that's what makes her, like, the best, Yes. Right? So I felt like that, uh, and just kind of like, what was were the lyrics and chords of that song on her iPhone? I don't know. Maybe. So, like, her phone was on. I Again, not flaming her for that, because, again, we, we've done plenty of shows where we're just like, hey, we'll give something a shot, something new, maybe just have the, the phone out, uh, just in case. But I think that is the difference between a singer of her caliber feeling and emoting a song, as compared to just kind of, like, playing a song with a bandmate. Hmm? I get what you mean. Right? So, again, people may say that this is, like, a criticism, but, like, I don't I don't mean that as a criticism. I just think that, uh, I I've, think I've just... been moved. I've, I, Aurora gives me chills sometimes in some yeah. of her other performances. I didn't, I didn't get that here. I just heard a great song by a great singer and a great performance. Yeah, I think it was just her in a different context. Because this song's not exactly depressing. And, like, I feel like it's harder to connect to a song that's more upbeat like this. I don't know. Or maybe, maybe, maybe she, I feel like it looks like she kind of wanted to, like, get up and, like, dance around. Yeah, right? I feel like she was kind of constrained because she was at the piano and... Yeah, even at the very end, it's like it kind of like came out with the hand motion. At, at the but, very end, and the yeah. difference between the end was the end was a little bit more ad-libbing. Yes. Less having to think about the lyrics of the song and trying to get things right. She could kind of just do the tag over and over again and kind of feel it. And that's when she started being herself a little more because she knew that, like, all right, I got past, like, the song. And yeah. then, and you can see it, like, when, no, she has those tells. That, like, when she's in the zone, you know that she's in the zone. She's working her magic. Tyrion. She's got the call down. She's sprinkling the fairy dust. Uh, I have no idea the what place. the context of this was. Like, yeah. honestly, they could have very well just, like, done this. Sure. So I was like, you know gold? It's like, I don't know. I listened to two seconds on my phone and do it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Maybe. I don't know. Like I, I said, it wasn't, it was great, but not one of her best. Yeah, it's not, like, one that you'd be, like, listening to on repeat, like, half the world away. Oh, half the world away. Oh, my gosh. That's, like, one of the best oh. performances that she's ever done. Oh, like. my gosh. That, Runaway, Through the Eyes of a Child. Oh, so many great ones. I know. Mm -hmm. But, yeah. Feel free to let us know what you think. Mm -hmm. And let us know what you think, uh, who your favorite Harry Styles is. <laughs> yeah. Again, I was more of a Zayn in the moment. I know, Zayn was pretty direct, cool. Yeah, that, that era. It was Zayn and Niall for me. Yeah. The squishies. Yeah, you know. Oh, um, no, Niall's Zane, squishy. Yeah, Niall's the squishy one. Zayn was the bad boy. Yeah. You know, a lot of people call me the bad boy of the YouTube guitar <laughs> community. <laughs> I mean, well, who would you call the bad boy, like Rick Rihanna? No, I listen. I've just been introduced. I feel like that's just by default, though. No, that you're the bad boy of the it's, guitar community. No, listen, who else is never, going to be? You never get to be the bad boy by default. You that definitely are earned. not default. That no titles. I earned it. Oh, okay. How did you? Would you care to explain to us how you by earned being it? Being a bad boy. <laughs> well, I'm so glad that uh -huh. you taught us the. Like, thing or two in this reaction video day. Yeah, I'm, I'm, just, I'm just talking. I don't know, I don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> That's what a bad boy what bad boys do. They don't play by the rules. What they say doesn't necessarily even make sense. Okay, well, thank you so much, Sean, for this beautiful... Glad to be here, you know? Uh, thoughts. These beautiful, beautiful thoughts, thoughts of, of mine. Mm -hmm. Maybe we'll see you in the next one.